having a flying party. Brown mama flew out. I saw two white ones fly out. We love this fencing. Love, 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 love this fencing. We just need to clip some turkey wings, I think. This used to be a beautiful thing, but these people messed it all up. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, they're so cute. Be careful not to smash when you, when you put it down. Oh, their eyes are open! Cute! Oh, Sam! Pull ah. it back up! Hurry! Look, there's one right here, Sam! Don't, don't smash! Ah. Ah. Bunny attack! We should not have opened that. Stay away, bunnies! Okay, hurry and take your arms out. Three, two, one. There we go. That works. <laughs> Nothing got smashed. I don't think so. I think her babies are still okay. We don't dare enter her lair. Check all the other burrows. Make sure nobody had babies in the night. You make a nest. It doesn't have one yet. Oh, darn it. Teamwork. I found two funny bugs. Oh, wow. No babies yet. This bag is stuck to it. <laughs> We're just gonna have a bag in our tomatoes. Oh, let it defrost. Just put it underwater. <laughs> My fingers are numb. Yeah, I we, can't uh, feel right here. We're trying to panic. So we put all of our tomatoes in the freezer. And we're gonna count them right now. Wow. Well, not right now. They've gotta thaw out a little bit. They, they would have rotted. They would be rotten by now. Yes, they would. I'm and gonna... we have freezers, well, freezers. We have turkeys that yeah, need to go in the freezer. Burgers. So we got to make some space. I'm we might need another bowl. Job. But it most it defrosted a lot. Ah! The skins are already coming off. <laughs> yeah, that's what a lot of people do to get the skins off. They freeze them, but we like the skins on, so leave the skins on. <laughs> Mom, you remember the recipe? Mm-hmm. Are we making that today? I'm just making bottled tomatoes, not taco soup. Oh. So cold it burns. We're also going to be making more elderberry syrup. Yeah! With lots of honey in it. Honest guys, I would rather feed these to the chickens than bottle them up today. But I don't think I have enough bottled tomatoes to get us until next season. You know, the kids really have enjoyed that taco soup that I made a couple of days ago. And I just, oh, I just don't want to. I don't want to. I've got some elderberry syrup going. Um, the kids are awesome. and They're getting some housework done. But, um, you know, I've never done this frozen before. I'm sure it can't be that difficult. We're just going to let them thaw out a little bit, and I'll cut the cords out and get them in bottles. I'm excited. I've got the bottles in the dishwasher going. I'm fighting a bit of a sinus infection, so I'm doing a lot of homeopathic things to try and get myself better without an antibiotic but I'm just kind of low energy just kind of tired but um, if I don't get this done then I don't have a space for the turkeys that we processed in the freezer so I've been hiding in some outdoor like cooler bags um, while they've been waiting for freezer space I may have to um, bottle some ground meats that I have in there just to make room. We just don't have room. But getting these tomatoes out is a good first step. I need to go out and assess how much room we need still. Two of the turkeys are going to be going over to Mama Grows um, in trade. She bought us the Tom that has fathered all of these turkeys. So two will be going to her, but I still have to house them until I can get to her. Well, it sealed good. Oh, I can't open the tank freezer. Oh my goodness. Well, hello. There's another thing in tomatoes. Well, guys, I need to defrost this freezer, but I 
I'm pretty confident that those turkeys are gonna fit. You guys forgot a bag. Emma's gonna love coming home to this. Right? I was hoping to get it done earlier today, so maybe the smell would dissipate because Jonah hates the smell too. You know, it's not the most pleasant smell, but when you're in the house, it's not a big deal. When you come home to the smell, it's like, whoa. <laughs> so, but luckily, you know, I think last year I made elderberry syrup in the garage, but oh well. So we're on the second, you know, we pressure cook the berries. And then now we're going to boil it down. So hopefully we'll get the house. And it's such a beautiful day, we could open windows. But yeah, we'll see. That'll be the first thing she says when she gets home, huh? Yeah, what stinks? Ew. My canning expert, Lisa at Sutton's Days, gave me a pro tip to put them in a pot on the lowest setting and let them defrost so I can get them in. She did say to put them in a crock pot or instant pot, but as you know, my instant pot is busy. It's getting close to being unbusy. Then I'll get these. Well, as many as I can put in the instant pot. But this is a little bit more work than I anticipated it being. It's going to be good, though. And we're going to be grateful for the tomatoes. <laughs> we have reached halfway status. Whoa. Had to go get Emma. So she left me in charge of her dirty work. I have to get two cups of honey. And I don't want to. She, not she, honey can't be heated over 117 degrees. So we checked the temperature with this thermometer right here. We checked the temperature and it's a little bit below it. So that's good. So all I have to do is just put the honey in and it will be fine. the last of the honey that I need to do. Now I have to put it in. I don't want to. Uh. We're safe. Here's my serving. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah, the smell? Yeah. Isn't it your favorite? Mm hmm How'd it go? It's almost... It, it went, dissolved? Almost dissolved, yeah. I started taking from this, I'm like, why am I doing that? So I moved to this, and I'm like, that's way better. Was it e easier? Yeah, and I had to use a hot pad because it was hurting my hands really bad. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, well, is this you. melt? Did you melt this? No, it didn't melt no. it. It's just easier Good. Than that. Thank you. So this is almost done? Okay. Maybe I'll pour the rest in our other algebra. That's beautiful. Back at it with the canning. After a while of me thinking that we were done. <laughs> How are you liking doing it this way though? I really hate it. Oh really? I really, really do. Um, I'm not a fan. I would rather have just pushed through and got them done. But you know what? Where I was at when we were doing it is I wouldn't have done it. I just wouldn't have. So I mean it's better than not having tomatoes, but I'm not a fan. So you have to like cook them down and then like immerse and blend them and then bottle them. It's just so much more work. It's so much easier for me to quarter them, throw them in a bottle, and be done. So I am not a fan. And I've got these tomatoes that I don't have room in my pots for. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. It is a beautiful sunny afternoon and we've finally gotten our fall back after a little tiny taste of winter. Um, I'm just coming out here to check on the goats and I thought I would tell you about this one thing that I'm kind of stressing out about, and I shouldn't even stress out about it. It's the 
pre-SAT tests. So at our school, we do an SAT. Everyone you probably know about it, but it's this like big, big old test that I have to take. And it, if you get a good score on it, you'll get into good colleges and everything. Well, I'm taking the pre-SAT, which doesn't even go on my grade. It tells me what I will get or what I can expect from the actual SATs, which will be next year, I think. And that's tomorrow, and I don't want to do it. It takes up a whole three and a half hours of your day. So my first, second, third, and maybe, and it will probably go into my fourth hour, will be taken up by the pre-SATs, and I do not want to do it at all. I think they need food, but I can't tell. But I really, really don't want to do it. So, Sam says to me, Mom, he has to figure watch a movie. Mm. He says, too many people are on Netflix. I don't know what's going on. I'm like, what? Emma's in a room studying. Missy wasn't on Netflix. So I text Emma. Yes, I was watching. I'm, I'm watching a movie while I'm studying. I was. It's called multitasking. Multitasking. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Watching a movie. I've done it before. And studying. I've done it before. Okay, so what are we studying for? And everybody will know why. The PSATs. Yes, <laughs> so this is kind of a big deal. It's, 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 this is just like what to expect from it though. So right. it's like, I don't know. Stupid dog. I don't understand. She's ne I, I don't understand. She's like never come on my bed before, ever. She's being really, really needy today. She's I like can tell. She's whining and she oh. needs some love. Okay, well, um, can you get to studying? Yes. <laughs> I have been though, I yeah. have. Yes. Okay, well, um, no more multitasking. Okay. When's your test? Tomorrow? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, good luck with that. I already talked about it on the box. Stay off your phone! Ow! Ow! Good luck. Oh! Go on! Sophie, go on! Go on! Not gonna happen. Go! I'm gonna fall off my bed! Ooh, I wanna watch that. Ow! She's on my hair! <laughs> A better, a better mom might help you, huh? Ugh! I'm not giving her attention. Maybe she'll just leave. <laughs> go on, Sophie, go on! Aha! Who made my bed today, do you know? Your brother. Oh, he's so nice. He did. He said, I made it the best I could. It was really good. And Other than see? this was up to here. Right. And that was... But did you see that he like snuggled in your animals? Yes. And you know, he really, so you have to say thanks. I will. And then he made my bed too. That's awesome. He's amazing. How did he know that my bed wasn't made? Because we were washing windows. Oh, did you wash my windows? We did. Awesome, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> so, Missy told him not to. Because you would not appreciate him in your room. I said, um, if he made your bed, I'm sure he wouldn't, you wouldn't care. Yeah. Yeah. He's a good boy. He is. Okay, this dog eats paper all the time. We did some research on it. And, um, it's a nutritional deficiency. So. So she needs some nutrients. So, we need to do some things. And I think we're going to change her food. Leave in the comments below what dog food you think is best for your dog. Or if you have a Springer Spaniel. What do you feed your Springer Spaniel? Is it she a Springer? Yes, she is. She's a yes. I hear whisperings from this door. Should we see what's behind door number two? Oh, it stinks in here. Yes, it does. Whoo! You guys are having fun? Yeah. That's awesome! No. No! No! She just totally attacked Emma. <laughs> yeah, and I have nails. 
purplish. Well, that's awesome. And that's not even dried yet. Well, that would be terrible to have it dog-haired. <gasps> oh, my gosh, my... Oh, you're going to touch it on the pillow. She Did almost... she get it? <laughs> she touched it, but she didn't get it. Sophie, come on. Come on. We are not wanted or needed. Let's go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, she's in... Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, my goodness. What are you doing? Watching Evan too. <laughs> Evan too. Sophie needs a little attention. Do you think she might need some attention? It's the time of day where everybody's just kind of chilling. Um, this is the time of day I usually get thinking about dinner. I should be thinking about it sooner. But you know, Jonah's on his way home. We have some activities tonight that we are going to be doing as a family. We're going to go down to the Logan Temple and the girls will be doing some temple work and the kids and I will just kind of walk around temple grounds because it's gorgeous. So that'll be a really nice thing to do tonight as a family. Um, these tomatoes are taking a lot longer than I had anticipated them taking. I don't think I'll do this again. I think that it's much easier for me. Do you like my messy, messy cupboards behind us? I think it's much easier for me to just do it. Just quarter them out and just get them done all at once. So maybe I'll love this method once it's all done. But it's definitely a lot more work than I had anticipated it being. But I'm really excited. I've gotten a lot of things done. This might be the end of canning season. Might be. <laughs> so we'll see till the next thing I forage up, right? But I mean, getting a thing of elderberry syrup done was really awesome. This adventure will continue tomorrow, so make sure you tune in for that. I'll kind of see when I'm done how I really feel about it. But thanks for joining us today here in our crazy adventure, and hopefully we'll see you tomorrow.